Hello, everybody, and welcome to this video where we are going to discuss how many lines should we be writing a week, a day, a month, whatever. This came um, as a question, and I'm just going to read the question here. This is from uh, Tanabaugh Design Boutique. It said, I'm curious, how many lines a week should we be aiming to write? Are we a fraud if we just collect lines and then assemble them later, kind of like how Cobain did? Granted, he wasn't a poet, and his songs were kind of him trolling to a certain extent. But I've always liked that kind of psychedelic Captain Beefheart nonsense writing that just leads the mind in weird directions. I write every day without fail, but I still look at stuff like Howl and think, damn, that's a long ass poem. <laughs> Personally, I like how poems look on a single page. So that's mainly the length I stick to, about 30 lines or less. I agree, like I, I love a poem that fits on a page. I've obviously written some that go all over the place and are like pages long. In my new chat book, I have one poem that's like eight pages long. Um, but that was just how long that poem wanted to be, you know? I'm trying to think, is 30 lines the typical... I wonder if book size matters on that. Like if, depending on what size your book is, if that changes. I should look at some smaller size books and see based on like font size and stuff. Now, uh, there's a bunch of things that I wanna say about this and I, I left a response, but I feel like I already have different views on this. So let me, let me think about this. Um, I said, I think if you're writing every day, that's the only thing that matters. Um, Oh, I completely fucked up typing. Um, write what you can when you can. What you feel when you feel it. I don't think there's a right or wrong answer here. Picking lines together after the fact is fine to do, especially if that is the target from the start. I would say doing that after the fact, after the fact might make it too disjointed, but it still should be fine. I've been toying with trying to do some stuff like Burroughs. Um, some cut up stuff like Burroughs, but I just don't know if I could do that and have it not sound ridiculous. Okay, so l let's hit that Cobain stuff first, and then we'll get to the how many lines should you write. I said in that thing, like, if you just want to take lines and jumble them up and put them wherever to make a poem, that's fine if that's what you want to do. And in that response, I said, especially if like that's your intention from the start. Like if you're just like writing lines and you know you're going to mix them up and stuff like that. And then I said, if you do that after the fact, it might make it disjointed. I don't know if that actually would. Like it might be fine. That's just something um, I don't really do. Because my whole thing with poetry is trying to say as much as possible in as few of words as possible and to be um, clear and precise and um, understandable, like directly. So I've never done anything like that before. Um, but I, I honestly don't think if you're doing that, any, like either way you do it should be fine. Even if you have like a big bag of lines that you haven't done anything with. I mean, I've done shit where you do the whole thing where you take a magazine and cut a bunch of words out and then like put them in a hat and then mix it up and then pull a word out and tape it to a page and do that and do that and do that. And then you go to the next page and do that and do that and do that. If I find that notebook, I'll show you when I used to do that. And then I turned that nonsense shit into um, Creeperson songs. So it is something that 
I've done and it is doable. I just don't do it very often. And then as far as how many lines you should write a day, I don't know. Like, I think creating every day is the most important thing, no matter what, no ma- even no matter what it is, whether it's like today you want to write a poem, tomorrow you want to um, paint, and then the next day you want to bake a cake, you know? Like, anytime you're creating anything is the most important thing. But if we are going to, like, bring it down like this and just look at it as poetry, I would say, um, I would say try to write a poem every day if you can, you know. Um, I know a lot of people like to spend a lot of time writing their poems, so... Instead of me telling you something that you need to do, just do the thing every day. However you do that. Whether it's a line, whether it's 30 lines, whether it's 180 lines. Trying to write daily, trying to create daily is awesome. And it doesn't have to be a lot. So even if you just write a title down for a book you want to write someday, there you go. You wrote that day. Um, and like, I would say try to do streaks, like see, like if you have any way of keeping track, um, a lot of people don't like doing shit like this cause it makes them feel bad when they fail. I don't want you to feel bad, but just why not just do the fucking thing and then you don't have to worry about making yourself feel poopy. You know, like, who fucking cares? This is just for you. No one's trying to make you feel bad. We're just trying to help you do the thing that you say that you want to fucking do. Okay? So, figure it out. I don't fucking know. And if you, if you like, fuck up your streak, who cares? Start another one. And do better that time. Like, none of this is supposed to make anybody feel fucking bad or guilty or fucking whatever. We're just fucking creating shit. Like, this isn't a fucking competition. None of this is. Who fucking cares? You know? Just do your fucking shit. I don't know why that turned into some, like, weird after-school special there. I didn't mean for that. But anyway, so, again, Anarchy Crew. Join the Anarchy Crew down below. There's, um, I think there's close to 200 videos, um, both of lessons and of um, workshops that you could um, watch back from like the last like two years. So all sorts of stuff. And plus there's new shit added all the time. And just so you guys know, as this channel moves forward, I'm going to start putting more and more stuff on the members things and less and less stuff on the main thing because um, the members fucking deserve it. I don't know another way of saying that. They're um, putting their money where their mouth is, I guess is the best way to put it. So I should be giving them more than I give everybody. So, um, no offense there, Hope, hopefully none taken, but yeah, so they're going to get more shit, and um, I don't know, you're not, mm, that seemed fucked up, anyway, join the Anarchy Crew, um, and you can get all this shit, my new book, fuck you, pick that up, type hard everybody, keep buying my books, join the Anarchy Crew, and I will talk to you all later. I just want to give a quick thanks to those people who make these videos possible. Anarchy Crew and my followers on Patreon, I appreciate the hell out of you guys. Thank you so much for keeping me going to keep this content possible. You guys are awesome. And if you'd like to join the crew of the Anarchy Crew, just hit the join button beneath this video. And if you'd like to become a member of my Patreon, you can run over to the link down below to do that as well. Thank you.